Since August 2021, thousands of Afghans who helped British forces against the Taliban remain stranded and at a potential risk from the Taliban. Well, according to a new report by MPs, this is because of failures of the UK government in their settlement schemes. Well, the Defence Select Committee's report urged the government to release the potential action that they are taking to ensure a safe passage for at least 4,600 Afghans to the UK. The list also includes the interpreters and contractors who worked for UK forces. Well, according to the committee's chairman, the withdrawal from Afghanistan was a dark chapter in UK military history. And for the Afghans, they are at risk of harm as a direct result of assisting the UK mission. He also added that the UK owes to those Afghans who place their lives in danger. The UK government, after their withdrawal from Afghanistan, started the Afghan Relocations and Assistance Policy, which is run by the Ministry of Defence. According to the UK Defence Ministry, 6,600 people have been relocated by last November under their programme. But it also added that 4,600 Afghans who were eligible under the scheme are still waiting to receive help. According to activists who are campaigning for stranded Afghan interpreters and others, the UK Home Office rejected the visas of some applicants who advised to relocate by the Ministry of Defence. Well, this has resulted in a sense of anger and rage in some Afghans who helped the UK. The report also said there is a lack of effective coordination across the government. The report also comes after the Foreign Affairs Committee highlighted serious and avoidable failings in the chaotic withdrawal.